Belisa. We are leaving Disneyland. We're heading out of the parking structure right now. And we're driving to... Oh. Head east toward Disneyland Drive. Okay. Since we go to Disneyland so often, and we stay in hotels sometimes, we thought maybe we'd get a place. And these just popped up brand new little places, so we're gonna go check them out. Yeah, buddy. West Broadway. Take the next left onto West Broadway. <laughs> it's like they're <laughs> two or three miles away. Oh my goodness. This is great. She says we are 0. 0.6 miles away and we've gone one mile. Plus the pile, yeah, under two miles away. Mm hmm. Continue on West Broadway for half a mile. I think they've converted that train. <laughs> that train is in a, to a condo. Awesome. We're living in a train. Choo choo. That might be cool to live in a train. Nope. In a quarter mile, turn left. I'm Laura? Nope. I think I see them right there. <laughs> oh, that might be them. They are. Yeah, they're little detached three story homes. Oh my gosh, honey. We could watch fireworks, Disneyland fireworks from there. Heck, I'll get in the car and drive you over two miles. <laughs> what the heck? That is. You think them. that's them? Man, they're off the freeway a little bit too. Take the next left, then your destination oh yeah, on Euclid. On the, right. on the right? Yeah, she wants me to turn in here. Here's the parking lot. No, take your next left. I am going to, because look, she wants to take me in. Oh yeah. Yeah, in here. That's correct. She's right. Okay. Right next to the mobile gas station. Do it, do it, do it, do I it. I wanted to make sure he was waiting. Thank you very, very much for waiting. Okay. As long as we don't have the half the one 
don't have to have the one that's over the looking over the gas station. So I don't know where the model where is. Where the model? Oh look, there KB. Yeah. Okay. Euclid Place. That side's probably the train tracks over there. All right, there's a parking spot right back here I'm gonna take, and then we can Just get park out. right there. These are people's driveways. I mean, I don't know if they're all taken yet, but I just don't wanna park in someone's driveway, you know? But I do wanna park right here. Where are the models? Construction dump only. Got lots of room. Yeah, beautiful. All right, we're in. Let's go see what we can see. All right, I'm in the three quarter bathroom. I'll film this one for everyone. Oh, look at this. Yeah, this is nice. Has a grandma. Downstairs. Has a grandma quarters. Yep, downstairs bath. Bedroom full bath down here. For my mom that can't get up the stairs. But this would be nice yeah. when she comes to Disney. Yeah. A shower, just a shower pan, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. It's nice. Okay. This is out to the garage. Yes. Light switch. Oh, oh, it did come on. Oh. oh. <laughs> Double picked it? Yeah. yeah. Nice. Oh, you're not doing tankless. So they're not tankless, uh, we're all electrical. Oh, okay. So these 50 gallon uh, all electric uh, water heaters are actually more energy efficient than a tankless, a gas tankless water heater. Okay. Yes. So there's no gas in your electric stove also then? Electric, yes. Okay, yeah. all right. Moving away from fossil fuel. So okay. I think California's trying to push everyone towards. Not that you need the heat at the coast very often, but it yeah. does give you electric heat. Is right. electric yeah. heat in the ceiling or how are they doing it's the heat? It's also gonna be forced air, but it's with an electric uh, oh, is it? Oh, okay. A little bit of no storage, storage under the stairs. Mm -hmm. All right, I understand that. I like the floor. Yeah, very similar, just a little different tone, different design. Yeah. A little different pattern. Well, that's better like the old days. Now I just told you how old I was that the electric coils were in the you know ceiling. What? My parents just sold a townhome that they had for 20 something years, 1970s. Uh -huh. And it had those little coils because we tried doing the crown only. Oh. So we weren't going to remove all that hot cheese uh, acoustics. And we started scraping, we started hitting like nails. There's and it. And it was all the coils. Yeah. And we're like, oh, that's what those boxes were for. And they were like little knobs. To turn on the heat. Oh yeah. It was yeah. That's really expensive to heat. To heat dad, like a toaster. So my dad had put tape on those since he bought it because he said if they stayed on, we had like a three hundred and something electric, electric bill. bill. Yeah. And if they wonder why the house was so hot, well, we didn't know, so we just turned it off. Oh. And they stayed like that for the whole month. <laughs> Look at this kitchen. Yeah. This is beautiful. Yeah. You see the tone makes a big difference. It does. It makes it a lot. It's something that I've learned when it comes to colors you choose on walls and countertops is that you get different reflections from you. Yeah, I like the white. Cat. We're I used like to. Oh, I like the more insane. We're used to the Honeywells, but are these Wi Fi? Those are Wi Fi. They are Wi Fi? Okay. Mm -hmm. I like that. So you can just throw an, you can throw an Alexa in here and tell her to write yeah. if you want. Oh, yeah, that's got it's a nice. lot. Wow. It's the same as the other one, just lighter. Yeah, I like the light though. I like the white yeah, really cabinets a lot. Mm -hmm. You see plenty of uh, natural light, plenty of windows. Yes. But so this one only has two, two bedrooms, bedrooms upstairs, upstairs and the one, one downstairs. downstairs. Right, so it's going to be dual master on the third. Because they, they each have their Which is better. Bathrooms. The other one that we looked at just had like a sitting room downstairs kind of. Yeah. And we probably wouldn't use that for right. anything. No. So it was better downstairs here as a bedroom. Unless you're going to work from home and just have at an office or oh, something. Yeah. We'll kind of get it out. Wow, this, this is, is nice. Same on this side, and then they just changed the back side. Right. Or the front, whatever side you want to call it. Yeah, this is really nice. So this is one of the master bathrooms. So there's not a tub, just so you know, in this entire house to soak in. That's true. But this you, is... you will have a, a, a tub in the, in the other room. The oh, there is. All right. You will. So those nights that you want to soak with the after, candles or that empty after, call. Or she, 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 she sits in a right. tub. <laughs> <laughs> so you do get it in this other. Oh, yeah. Look, here's 
the tub. Mm -hmm. All right. Give it a little. Definitely need to have the tub at least in one, one restroom. That didn't want to turn right back off instantly. Oh, this is nice. So the difference was, as you, as you saw in the other one, right? The other one split in half, and it's the, the two two bedrooms, bedrooms over two here. Yeah. So this one was just. And they share that bathroom. Mm -hmm. I do like this better. I do too. I like this one better. This is nice. Right. I'm good. All right, everybody. So you all saw how close we are here at Disneyland. So if you're interested in one of these units, except the one that we're standing in right now, you cannot have uh, <laughs> number 12, but they only have a handful left. So you better get here quick and talk to Raul and find out what they have available for you if you're interested. The address of the sales office here is 309 South Quadrilateral Way. If you can spell that, good for you. <laughs> in Anaheim, California. And make sure again that you ask for Raul Garcia. He'd be happy to help you out, walk you around. He spent a lot of time with us today showing us what they had available. And it's really, really nice here. We really, really love it. I hope you enjoyed our video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Bye.